We begin with breaking news. A Shannon man accused of threatening to crash a plane into a Tupelo Walmart died in federal custody. The Federal Bureau of Prisons just sent me a letter about what happened to Corey Patterson. Jeremy Dressler with the Federal Bureau of Prisons says on Monday around 1.20 Eastern Time, inmate Corey Patterson was found unresponsive at the Federal Detention Center Miami in Miami, Florida. Responding staff members immediately initiated life-saving measures. They also also requested EMS and life-saving efforts continued, but Patterson subsequently died. The Federal Bureau of Prisons says Patterson arrived at FDC Miami on November 10th right. under a pre-trial status. Now, you may recall the 29-year-old Patterson faced state and federal charges after Tupelo police say he stole an airplane from the Tupelo Regional Airport on September 3rd. A criminal complaint claimed Patterson wanted to kill himself and cause chaos in the process. Now, he flew the plane wildly over North Mississippi for hours. Patterson Patterson eventually landed the plane in Tippa County, where he was arrested. A federal grand jury indicted Patterson in September. His attorney, Tony Faris, requested a psychological evaluation of Patterson, in which a federal judge granted his request. That was on, it happened back in September. So again, Corey Patterson died in federal custody in Miami. We will continue to bring any updates when it becomes available to us.